Well, I played Rocket, and I played a, about a thousand other apes in the background. So there were five of us that played Pepper, all of those apes. So whenever you see armies of apes charging over the bridge and through the trees, that's, that's five of us. <laughs> it's fun. It is fun to be like an ape. I just love it because you just can just... You feel so real. You feel so honest and so open. You're looking at stuff like a, like a baby, you know? So there's this real deep connection with the legs. I'm not gonna claim myself as an ape expert, but I do watch and observe, and I'm a good observer of movement and behavior. That's, that's what my talent is. And I think, and having observed them, I've got to spend time with two chimps many years ago um, on Tim Burton's apes, and then um, went to the zoo like for hours on end and watched videos like crazy. They're just so simple, you know? It's so, it's all in the subtleties. All this, so much communication goes with just you know, just a little tiny, tiny gesture. So you're not, ah, ah, you're not playing anything. You have to have a real keen imagination, really, to really do the motion capture stuff. It's, it's the subtleties, the little nuances that make them so intricate and intriguing and interesting. Three, two, one, action. Oh, I can't stop it. And for, it takes me about, uh, four months to get out of it. My wife's like, can you sit up, please? You're like slouching still from the apes. It's like, cause I'm sitting there at dinner, you know, like, because it feels good. It's like, oh yeah, sorry, honey. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, here we go. Woo-hoo-hoo! <laughs>